come out while doing this. Yeah. You know, it comes from practicing against these guys every day. Yeah. You know? we the same. Um, they push me to get better. They push one to get better. We all just push each other. You know, one, one of the best out of each other. I'm just going to take it stride by stride. And, you know, How are you feeling getting to the elite eight? Uh, it's, it's amazing. It's a great feeling. You're not satisfied yet. Still have some work to do. How do you guys always say that? I mean, every time you guys get a huge win and it's always not satisfied, not satisfied. Where does that come from? That drive? Coach Army, he's continuing to push in this. Uh, it's, a, it's, it's obviously a big game, but at the same time, we can't get too high about this win because we got another great team to play. How much do you guys talk about that? seems like you guys have all, had a lot of big wins this year and very little time you've, you've had a drop off. You've always been able to get over a big win like this and be ready for the next game. Where does that come from? Uh, just practicing, just getting prepared, uh, taking care of Ben's off the court. I feel like you guys were going to have this many dunks and it seems like everything you guys got was at the rim. We just wanted to not settle. Uh, they did a great job of switching up their uh, defenses. Uh, we just wanted to draw the ball and make, make plays for our teammates. Was this an opening statement for this program? Being Duke and now people are probably going to be talking a lot about you guys moving forward. Uh, I got no idea. Uh, it's, it's a big win. Uh, uh, these guys made it all possible. We just wanted to go out there and compete. What do you think of Jordan Bell's play for you guys tonight and his importance of the, getting this win? Jordan played well. Uh, I think that's why we did so good running the shoes off the line. Because we knew if we got beat, they drove it by us. Jordan was back there and Chris was back there contesting shots. Is Casey playing maybe his best game of the year? I mean, I think he scored like 13 or 12 points and he also had like a career high eight assists. Casey always plays solid. He always makes plays for us. He always calms us down. And he makes open shots. So we need for him. Why is it that, what does he do or bring to the floor when you know, Duke's making a quick run and getting a little closer? Sir, and he comes in and just things seem to just go calm and you guys get back to, to running. He, he controls the tempo out there. He gets the ball in his hands, he gets his sets, he gets in our plays and uh, he's always talking to us and just making sure we're in the right place. I think you were talking to, to Chris at halftime. It looked like you were you know, pretty intense right before the game started. What were you telling Chris? Uh, continue to play hard. Just come out and compete. And, uh, just attack. Just attack. What do you think of Brandon Ingram? Uh, He's a great player. He gave us fits out there, and he was a handful. Any thoughts about playing Oklahoma and Buddy Hield? Uh, they're a great team, well coached. They got a ton of athletes, and they should be well too. Thanks a lot.